Yo, what's up, guys? It's X Rays. Welcome back to another Exo Zombie video. Really quickly, I want to thank you guys again so much for the support that you guys gave me these last couple of days. But today we have a special video, guys. We're going to be talking about a way for you guys to basically have a poor man's version of the mule kick in Exo Zombies. Now, for you guys are probably wondering, what the hell does he mean? There's no mule kick ability in Call of Duty Exo Zombies. Well, no, there isn't. But there is a way for you to carry a third weapon with you. Now, some of you guys probably already know it. Some of you guys probably didn't even think about it. But I'm going to explain what it is, how to do it, and why it's so awesome so now before we actually jump into it though guys if you guys do enjoy the video make sure to slap a like and a favorite on the video it does get the content out there helps my channel grow and of course if you are new and you enjoy exo zombie advanced warfare whole bunch of content guys then make sure to subscribe so you guys don't miss any videos now with that said let's talk about what this thing is so basically in exo zombies we have this cool thing where you get little drops from the sky that give you different score streaks they give you points sometimes credits and well there's one that a lot of people kind of tend to overlook which is the turret now the turret is an awesome little kind of score streak to use you place it down and start shooting sometimes it's rockets sometimes it's lasers uh, and I have yet to see it but maybe there's one that's just a regular turret so when you get these laser turrets that so you place them down and you can use them to distract zombies they'll go after that one or you can use it to kill zombies but there's also a third ability to it which is you can actually double tap X and you'll pick it up kind of like a mini turret so that's really awesome it's one that you can kind of keep in the back pocket in case you run out of weapons on your primary and your secondary you can switch over now the one downside to this is as I've noticed is when you have it as a regular turret it'll actually kind of last a little bit longer but if you're carrying it with you it has like a percentage of it that goes down similar to the em1 uh, when you're using it so if you have this guy it's going to run out relatively quickly but it's definitely a great option for you to use if you're in a tight situation where you ran out of ammo you need a few seconds to kind of get your bearings back together shoot down a wave of them and then get to you know the upgrade machine or do something to get a different weapon so i wanted to share this trick with you guys i know maybe a lot of you guys already knew about this maybe you didn't i want wanted to show this to you guys the rippable laser turret which i think is a really awesome weapon to have as your third one all you really do is click the d-pad and it'll pull it out just like a score streak and honestly it's a really awesome thing to just have in your back pocket but anyways guys thank you so much for watching the video hopefully you guys learned something hopefully this video helped you if it did make sure to slap a like and a favorite on the video it does get the content out there it helps the channel grow and i just want to say i think exo zombies has been pretty cool and apart from that I think there's more stuff to Exo Zombies that we haven't necessarily seen yet, so I'm really excited. Everyone's still kind of scavenging around, seeing if they find anything else. If you guys find anything, let me know. I'll definitely cover it and give you credit. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. Until next time, like, comment, subscribe, and make sure some out. Peace.